Today on The Trek, we're helping save a baby's life. I am here with Lisa Price, simulation coordinator here at Ivy Tech. Lisa, there is some really intense simulation technology here. Now tell me, how does this prepare the nurses uh, that you are working with in this program to be working in the field? We have lots of simulators that help the students learn how to process, to think, and to apply the information that they're learning in our nursing program. Like today, we're gonna be uh, doing a cord prolapse for OB, and they don't get to see that too much out there, but in their lifetime, if they're going to be an OB nurse, mm -hmm. chances are they're going to see at least one or more of these. The scenario that we're doing today is a real life scenario. That's amazing. And so you're going to let us kind of be a fly on the wall and participate in that simulation with real students. Yes, absolutely. I cannot wait. Let's dive into it. Hello. Hello. My, my name is Precious and I'll be your nurse today. Can you tell me your name and your birthday? Carrie Jones, 413-2000. If this patient came in uh, 33 weeks gestation, which means she's pregnant for 33 weeks, and that's preterm. The student nurses doing their assessments, they found that the cord was prolapsed, which means the baby's head can compress the cord and shut off the oxygen to the baby. Um, I'm having pain and contractions, and they're getting worse even with the medicine. Um, we're going to call the doctor, and we're going to see what we need to do from here, okay? Then surgery is called to tell them that they will be coming so they can get prepared to do an emergency C-section. They learn about cord prolapse in lecture. They don't really see it happen in the hospital. And so by producing this, they're able to experience it, see what that looks like, hopefully do the right treatments, the right corrections for it. All right, we're going to the operating room now. This is where a lot of the learning happens. They happens at the hospital, but we can't make a patient code. We can't make a patient have a cord prolapse. We can't make a patient have sepsis or septic shock, but we can here, and that's where they then process that. Nursing is just one of the 70 programs available here at Ivy Tech. To find out which program is right for you, visit ivytech.edu slash the track, or stop by any of the 43 locations in Indiana to schedule your tour today.